Alert update, Tyco Fire Products reaches a $750 million settlement over PFAS pollution. In a statement released today, one of the law firms involved in the litigation against Tyco called the settlement a significant triumph. In January of last year, researchers with the University of Madison released a study that traced pollution of forever chemicals in the area back to Tyco. The Wisconsin DNR also found the contamination stemmed from Tyco fire training site in Marinette. At the training site, Tyco employees would set fires and put them out with a firefighting foam containing PFAS. The foam made its way into local waterways and the company put an end to the practice in 2017. The settlement still needs court approval, but once approved, the money will go directly to supporting public water systems in removing PFAS from drinking water supplies.